On Tuesday, oil prices fell sharply on demand fears as the U.S. summer driving season ends. The Euro's former chief said a no-deal Brexit is the most likely outcome of the trade talks. Japan's second quarter GDP revised down, and a measure of Australian business conditions fell sharply in August. Welcome to the TechMill Update. I'm Kiana Daniel, the founder of the Investiva Movement. Make sure to subscribe to the TechMill YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your forex trading friends. On Wednesday, all eyes will be on Bank of Canada's interest rate decision. Today, I'm looking at the CAD yen pair, which appears to have topped out at 81.72 in the process of forming a double top bearish reversal chart pattern. The pair remains above the daily Ichimoku cloud with the future cloud appearing bullish. So we are still in a wait and see mode. We wouldn't be fully bearish unless the pair confirms a break below the 79 pivot level. Now, do you think this is a temporary pullback for the CAD yen pair? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Take Mill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates tomorrow.